Welcome to Silicon Valley Asian Business Talk. Hello, everyone. This is Roger Chen from University of San Francisco Center for Business Studies and Innovation Asia Pacific. Anita, uh, welcome to join our interview program. We want to first thank you for supporting us. Would you please briefly introduce yourself? Thank you, Roger, for this opportunity. My name is Anita Manwani, and um, I have been in Silicon Valley for many, many decades, uh, way before some of the freeways were in place. And uh, but my story kind of uh, goes back a long ways. I came here as a student, and now I uh, currently I'm the CEO and founder of a lab information management solution software company. The company is called Relims. We are doing business as Relims, though we started out as Carobar Business Solutions. And uh, prior to that, I was a senior executive with Agilent Technologies and Hewlett Packard. And uh, I, prior to that, I was in a startup as a, in a robotics company. And uh, I have two hats. My other job, which is a voluntary job, is the president of Thai Silicon Valley. And Thai has been around for 30 years. So we'll talk about that, you know, uh, later on in this conversation. Discussion topic, benefits of work-life balance on venture business. The other lesson as an entrepreneur that I have gotten is that we, I have to find balance. Um, if you're not fueled well, and if all you're doing is your startup and don't have the balance, and I have gone through those phases within my entrepreneurial journey where the focus has only been my company. And in that mm -hmm. process, I have, um, you know, you, you kind of lose your bearing a little bit. And, uh, and so, Ever so often, you have to kind of, you know, stop. There will always be peaks and valleys where you're putting in those 14 hours. All you're doing is your company and nothing else. But um, I have realized that I have to focus on my um, other activities. I have to find time to spend just some chill time with friends. I have to find time to actually... Um, to exercise. And when I do that, it's amazing as you talk to people, you have to spend time with your network. Because as you talk to people, you get nuggets for your business that you can draw from that. So the mm -hmm. networking piece is very important. Sitting at your desk, which we've all gotten used to in front of our screens during pandemic, being with your team, that's good, but not good enough you have to go out into that broader network and uh, share what's going on. And so that was a big lesson for me in those peaks and valleys. I, I like meeting people, uh, but the pandemic kind of put me into this mode of, you know, here was this great opportunity for the solution. All we did was, you know, work with our, our ecosystem, which was the clients and the, and the team internally. And the, and so that was a, that I think is important. Balance in life was uh, something that I learned very quickly during the pandemic years. So it was actually the work-life balance. And uh, it seems to me you're saying it's not uh, not only kind of a helps the productivity, but also give you some creativity, you know, yes. kind of giving the energy back, I guess. That's so we talk about the benefits mm -hmm. of non kind of a start of business activities. Thank you for watching.